He has a high level gardening skill and helped out on his own free will. This man's getting wifed up. I said what I said. <laughs> Remember what I said about the urge to cause chaos? Yeah, let's get pregnant and give up our baby for adoption. <laughs> I love my brain. Okay. Well, hello. Welcome to my channel. I know y'all hear that little beat in the back. Wait a minute. Don't ask me to be smart on here. I'm playing video games. Leave me alone. Let me play my video games. You need to leave me alone. Oh my gosh. <laughs> They're attacking me. <laughs> I feel attacked. No. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Oh my. What's the point of the game? She has nothing left to live for. Oh my. Are you serious? <laughs> Last week, I gave you guys a tutorial <laughs> on how to play The Sims 4 like it was 2014. There are a lot of new Simmers out there, so I wanted to extend the olive branch. I suggest you watch the original video to get in on the inside jokes. All right, let's jump back in and take a trip back to the times when everything was simple. Here is The Sims 4, but it's the year 2014. <laughs> Did anyone used to get bored of the everyday hard grind of managing your sims lives and then get this sudden feeling to, I don't know, cause physical and emotional damage to everyone around you? No, just me. <laughs> okay, let's just throw a party and move on. If you don't use speed three throughout the night, there's something you're not telling us? Oh, you're a liar. <laughs> I am completely against diagnosing any sort of mental illness without having any prior education, but I don't think I need a degree to understand she's got some issues. <laughs> As a child, my playstyle was nowhere near family friendly, but I know I was not the only messed up kid telling grown people stories that should have stayed grown people business. <laughs> Imagine how uncomfortable it would be to sleep in this. The straight delusion a 15 year old could have. <laughs> he has a high level gardening skill and helped out on his own free will. This man's getting wifed up. I said what I said. <laughs> Remember what I said about the urge to cause chaos? Yeah, let's get pregnant and give up our baby for adoption. <laughs> <laughs> I love my brain. Of course, we'll never tell the father. Plant all the seeds for storytelling. <laughs> There's just something so despicable about this woman that gives me the feeling of great satisfaction. I love it. We live up for a toxic queen. Who writes a fantasy book and titles it The Good Mother? Catherine does, apparently. Hmm, maybe Catherine's are just destined for chaos and destruction. All right, let's find an unsuspecting family and drop off 18 years of responsibility. A tip number one, out the gate, fail. She insulted this man. Look at him, he's fuming. <laughs> Next, a tip number two, they don't flush the toilet. Automatic no. The baby is starving and this marriage is as strong as Catherine's morals after a couple of drinks. She might have to test that later down the line. <laughs> anyway, a tip number three, creative and a romantic, my kind of girl, but she's gloomy. That's fine, she's a little emotional. She'll do fine. I knew it was a girl. All the pieces keep falling into their toxic little places. <laughs> I don't think I ever had a sim sleep through a crying baby. She might be the trashiest sim I've played without being straight up evil. Is that gameplay depth? No, it can't be. What's the best way to get over giving up your firstborn to a literal stranger? Rushing into a wedding. Let's pick a partner, one out of five. Nixon it is. He ditched us, but not a problem. There are perks to having extreme self-confidence. It's borderline delusion to the point of picking out your wedding dress before popping the question. If she wasn't straight trash, these would be kind of cute. Aw, now I feel bad. He has no idea what he just signed up for. <laughs> and let's end it off with a congrats to the newly wedded couple. Let's see how long this lasts. I have a feeling a lot of you feel seen right now. I know you do. If you made it this far, drop a timestamp of the most iconic part of this video with absolutely no context. You guys here from TikTok, make sure you drop one of these in the comments. Y'all have a special place in my heart, my little toxic fairies. Or feel free to come up with a better name. You're probably 10 times more creative than me. And finally, thank each and every one of you for 500 subscribers. We could officially be seen as an illegal disturbance if we all met 
split up. Weird analogy, but anyway. <laughs> Special shout out to Doll Skies, the honorary 500 subscriber. We did it, we out here. Let me know if you guys have any ideas for a 500 subs video special. I'm feeling wild, so I'm ready to catch whatever y'all throw at me. Okay, I'm all out of juice, gotta recharge. Thank you guys for coming on this journey with me and can't wait to see where it takes us. Bye! Hey, you liked this video, didn't you? Okay, why don't you go ahead and click the like button and then watch this video. Or you can watch this video. You know, same vibe, get your life. Okay, I'll leave you alone. Bye! <laughs>